Hello friends, I'm Dee, about to react to this vid. This is Watch Celebrities Cry Inside. Um, so yeah, we're going to see them face extreme embarrassment and uh, we're going to enjoy it because uh, we're cruel people like that. Let's watch. I once thought Pete Davidson was just like Obama biracial goofball who ruined a once beloved institution, but it turns out I was wrong. Pete's not biracial. Oh my God. Good one. And now for the man of the hour. So I know you're a funny dude as well. Because the other night I told one of your super funny jokes to a supermodel, and she was laughing while I was banging her brains out with a pile of money on the floor of my motherfucking mansion. So now let's get to the real situation, my man Donald Trump. What people are hating on him because Trump is always firing people, but it's kind of okay because he completely let himself go anyway. And I want to thank also the, the men and women oh, so from the wonderful company that I helped grow, World Wrestling Entertainment, because without them, I could not be standing oh, here on this stage tonight. So I want to thank them. Is Mr. Lala? And of course, I'd like to thank my husband, Vince, who stood beside me and behind me all the way through this. Oh, he's still kicking. He's 76. All right, Vince. Okay. Hi. Got Hi, what's your name? A net worth of 2.2 billion. Diana. Oh, boy. Oh, that's Jim Carrey. He's that's your stylist today. It's, it's completely it's sexless, Diana. the Lloyd thing. <laughs> okay, yeah. so... Yeah, are you sure you want to do this? Yeah, yeah. All oh, right. great. I think, uh, 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 I think at this he's point... He's going to do a good job. At uh, this point, I think I know what I'm doing. Let's go back to Tim Carey out on Hollywood Boulevard to see how that haircut is going. Oh, wow! I know you are. Wow! See? Bitch, they better that pay you unexpected. top dollar yeah. for this. It's... It symbolizes the control I have over the mind of my fans. <laughs> Were you expecting a um, haircut of that severity? Me? Yeah, you. No, I came down just to see the show. Oh, you did? Okay. This gotta be an act. It's it better be. Many ways and you better have got paid a lot. It's the lasting damage to the survivors' will to rebuild and remain in the area. The destruction of the spirit of the people of southern Louisiana and Mississippi may end up being the most tragic loss of all. George Bush doesn't, doesn't care, care about black, black people. people. Please call. It's <laughs> fucked up. Yeah. I'm energy-wise. Energy-wise. We talked yeah. about this before. He you knows that I just can't stand him. Are you tired? Excuse me. I'm kidding. I love that. Not really, I do. Like, if you, you just won in six years most awkward start to an interview. <laughs> I think. <laughs> This one you might not want to pet because oh they're spiky. Oh my god. Now. Billboard 200, number two. This summer, and now we welcome one. <laughs> Guys, I'm the worst reader. Um, <laughs> they're only getting bigger. Take a look. What does that say? Mariel. Mariel Street. Mariel Street. Oh, 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 oh my gosh. And she's the sassy sheriff. That sassy sheriff. <laughs> Springs and oh, southern that accent. He is not. Well, amazed. hi everybody. It's nice to see you. Bitch, those guns though. Yeah. Like Seventeen years later. Um. Thank you. For your face. To the HFPA moving. for inviting me back to the family reunion. Um. Especially with all these extraordinary ladies this year. I mean it. Your work moves me. Mm. It moves me. Darn and me. I've been cheering for y'all from theater seats for a moving. long time. Who is this? Being on a list with you is cool. Two thousand years later. Um, who thinks they're agents first? Me? Um, 
Kevin Hubain, uh, Brian Lord, Peter Levine, Nicole Perna, Dom, Appel, Macy, John Carabino. My partners in crime. I just have to thank you. Is she on drugs? For always reminding me that the top doesn't Girl, matter. spit it all. God damn, this is a long ass thing. Kill me. We're nearly done. She's three. It's already. Right. Um. <laughs> That's how I feel about horror shows. That's why I do not like this. On the electric. There you go. so long ago. Oh, yeah. It turned into a high five and it just fell apart. It was, I never want to do that again. Well, Mike, I have this uh, mic on, so. Yeah, that's all right. Be a f gentleman and help me out with my phone. <laughs> But from the looks on their faces, uh, it's a no anyway. We don't need to hear it. Oh, he like he in pain. Oh, he don't like it. I thought I was really a Nazi, you know, uh, because my family was German, Hartmann, uh, which also gave me some pleasure. <laughs> so, what? Uh, kind of, uh, yeah. I, 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 what can I say? Um, I, I understand Hitler. Uh, he's not what we, you would call She's a good guy, but I, um, yeah, I, I understand much about him, and I sympathize with him a little bit. Yes, not, in, but come on, I, I'm not for the Second World War. She wants to say something, and I'm not against Jews. Susanna Beers. No, no, not even Susanna Beer. Um, that was also a joke. Just I am, stop. of course, uh, very much for you. Identity was really questioned, and I think it, it explores that oh, okay. in a really smart way. Um, well, you know, you, oh, I was going to say. Yeah. <laughs> Has that happened with your son? Once, three, uh, when he was 13. He, he walked in on me giving my husband a favor. He, he didn't hear anything, he saw the TV. And then he looked, and what do you think we did? Continued. But I thought that <laughs> Girl, that's nasty, I would have never thought that for you, the uh, I, I think I met you at Snatch, I don't think you remember that, the uh, premiere of Snatch, the movie years ago, which they were really Cool dudes in there. Benicio was in that, right? Benicio, Brad, uh, who else was in it? Oh, was oh, I was there. Oh, look at oh, would I get beat up quick in England? Oh my God, Spady or lady? Look at Not this guy. You live like you that was me at the premiere. Is that hysterical? I didn't know how I got into that because I didn't know you, but maybe I, I was famous back then. But. We, uh, I this thought it was so a great awkward. movie. That was super cool back then. I knew it was at the DGA. Like... Remember that? <laughs> Have you done this interview before? <laughs> Keep going. Or don't, because that was just awkward. Like, uh, he really wanted to show us that he was in that movie and show us that throwback picture when he thought he was fine and he was not, but sure. Um, yeah, these were some uncomfortable moments. You know, celebrities definitely have awkward moments for sure and it's crazy because you would think they have all of this confidence and they're so sure of themselves but no they'd be super insecure and fucking up just like the rest of us you know it is what it is anyway y'all let me know what y'all thought let me know what other videos you want to watch i'll see y'all the next time bye